So here we have a trigonometric uh, problem. We're going to have one triangle where we need to solve for the lengths of other sides. So if we're given a triangle that looks something like this, we don't really know all of the angles, but we're given a couple. We're given one angle is 30, 30 degrees here, and the opposite of that is length 2. We're also given that one of these angles is 40 degrees. So 40 degrees and 30 degrees. Now what we need to find is what is the length of the side that's opposite the 40 degrees. So that's our unknown. We'll call it x. And then we're just going to solve for that in whatever way we can. To do that, we're going to use the law of sines. So what that says is the sine of some angle in any triangle divided by the opposite side's length is equal for each set of those opposite length angles for each of the three sides here. So in other words, sine of 40 over x, sine of 40 degrees over x is equal to sine of 30 over 2. So now we just need to go through here algebraically and solve for x. So we're going to multiply both sides by x, and then we're going to divide by sine 30 and multiply by 2. So then we'll just get x by itself. We'll have this over here. We've multiplied by 2 and divided by a sine of 30. So we have x is equal to 2 times sine of 40 degrees divided by sine of 30 degrees. This comes directly from the sine law, and we can just plug this into our calculators and solve. This just gives us x is equal to approximately 2.57. One. And there we have it.